Vera Yevanyevna Dushavina is a Russian professional female tennis player. She was born in Moscow and now resides in nearby satellite city of Kimki. Early life, Dushavina began playing tennis at the age of seven under her father, Yevany, an engineer. Her mother, Elena is a teacher. Tennis career. Equals early years equals, Vera played her first main draw match at the 2002 J&S Cup by qualifying, but she lost to Virginia Rano Pascual 6 a Euro 1, 7 a Euro 6, 2. She was able to win her first WTA Tour match at the 2003 Nasdaq 100 Open, after qualifying she defeated Patricia Watush 6 a Euro 0, 6 a Euro 3 but lost to fourth seed Justine Hun in 6 a Euro 3, 6 a Euro 2 in the second round. She then won her first professional tour title at the ITF in Innsbruck, Austria coming through the qualifying draw and defeating Melinda Zink 7 a Euro 6, 4. 6 a Euro 2 in the final. In her next tournament she was able to reach her first WTA Tour semi-finals at the 2003 Nordi Nordic Light Open including defeating her first top 50 player, world number 35 Denise Akla DKOVA 6 a Euro 2, 6 a Euro 3 but lost to Jelena Kostania in the semi-finals. She then played her first slam main draw match after qualifying but lost to Ashley Hark Elrode 6 a Euro 4. 6 a Euro 2 in the first round. In the 2003 Kremlin Cup she upset then world number 28 Lisa Raymond 6 a Euro 2, 7 a Euro 6, 4, but lost to 7th seed Vera Zvanova 6 a Euro 2, 6 a Euro 1. Equals 2005 a Euro 2009 equals, Vera began her 2005 campaign by losing in the first round at the 2005 Canberra Women's Classic to Anna Lena Graal Paragraf and felled 7 a Euro 5, 6 a Euro 4. At the first slam of the year in the 2005 Australian Open, she was able to reach the fourth round for the first time in a slam losing to fifth seed Svetlana Kstsova 6 a Euro 4, 6 a Euro 2. Along the way she won her first top 20 victory over then world number 11 Vera Zvanova 6 a Euro 3, 6 a Euro 3 in the second round. She then qualified for the 2005 Open Gaz de France and 2005 Dubai Tennis Championships but fell to Dinara Safina 6 a Euro 2, 6 a Euro 4 in the second round and to Nathalie Decci 6 a Euro 7, 1, 6 a Euro 4, 7 a Euro 6, 4 in the first round respectively. She then lost four straight matches in the second round of the 2005 Nasdaq 100 opening the first rounds of 2005 Bausch and Lom Championships, 2005 J&S Cup and 2005 Qatar Total German Open. She then bounced back by reaching the quarterfinals of the 2005 International de Strasbourg losing to eventual champion Annabel Medina Garrig 6 a Euro 7, 2, 7 a Euro 5. 6 a Euro 1. She however had a bad draw at the 2005 French Open losing to 21st seed Mary Pierre 6 a Euro 2. 7 a Euro 5. Dushavina reached her first Women's Tennis Association singles final at the 2005 Hastings Direct International Championships as a qualifier she finished as runner-up to former world number one Kim Klidge to 7 a Euro 5. 6 a Euro 0. In the said tournament she won her first top 5 victory over then world number 3 armor copyright Lime Moresmo 6 a Euro 4, 6 a Euro 4 in the second round. However, she fell in the first round of the 2005 Wimbledon to Arno Ivanovic 6 a Euro 4, 6 a Euro 3. She then bounced back to reach the semi-finals of the 2005 Nordine Nordic Light Open losing to Katerina Spotnik 6 a Euro 0, 7 a Euro 5. She then reached the second round of the 2005 Pilot Pen Tennis losing to Elena Dementieva. She then suffered back-to-back -to, -back to loses to Shaha Peo at the second round of 2005 US Open and first round of 2005 China Open. She then fell at the quarter-finals of the 2005 Han Sol Korea Open to top seed Jelena Jankovia 5 a Euro 7, 6 a Euro 3, 6 a Euro 3. She then lost in the first round of the 2005 Kremlin Cup to Elena Lakovtseva 3 a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 2, 7 a Euro 5. She then avenged her lose to Jankovia at the 2005 Generali Ladies Linz defeating the Serbs 7 a Euro 6, 6, 3 a Euro 6, 
6 a Euro 0 in the first round, but fell to Sibyl Bama in the next round. Dushabina had a poor 2006 season. She reached in the second rounds of 2006 ASB Classic and 2006 Medibank International losing to top 10 players Nadia Petrova and Justine Hennin respectively. She then fell in the first round of the 2006 Australian Open to Catalina Castor plus or minus O in straight sets. She then fell in the second rounds of 2006 Open Gaz de France and 2006 Dubai Tennis Championships to then world number two on the copyright line Moresmo and then world number four Maria Sharapova, respectively. She then suffered a back to back first round loss at the 2006 Qatar Total Open and 2006 Nasdaq 100 Open. She then earned her best performance of the year by reaching the third round of the 2006 Bausch & Lomb Championships losing to Patty Schneider 6 a Euro 3, 7 a Euro 5. At the 2006 Historial Open she was upset by Antonella Serrazinetti 6 a Euro 4, 6 a Euro 4 in the first round. She then suffered four consecutive second round exits at the 2005 Qatar Total German Open and 2005 French Open to then world number one armor copyright Lime Moresmo, the 2006 Indonesian Ili BNL d'Italia to Patty Schneider, and the 2006 Hastings Direct International Championships to Annalena Graal Paragraph and Feld. She then fell five consecutive first round main draw matches that she played. At the 2006 Wimbledon, 2006 J.P. Morgan Chase Open, 2006 Rogers Cup, 2006 U.S. Open, and the 2006 China Open. She then reached the second rounds of the 2006 Han Sol Korea Open and 2006 AIG Japan Open Tennis Championships. She then suffered back-to-back -back main draw match to compatriot Vera Zvinovan at the 2006 Kremlin Cup and 2006 Gaz de France Stars. Two years later, she reached her second final at the Nordi Nordic Light Open, losing in straight sets to Anska Rydwarska. Dushavina reached the final of the Stockholm event again in 2007, losing to Caroline Wozicki. Dushavina has won one doubles title, the Warsaw Open, playing with Tatiana Peribinis in 2007. She was also a part of the winning Russian team in the 2005 Fed Cup winning doubles ties in the quarter-finals and semi-finals finals partnering Danara Safina. Dushavina began writing a blog for Eurosport about her time on the tour in 2009. In June 2009, at the Icon International in Eastbourne, she lost in 45 minutes to Canadian Alexandra Wozniak in the quarter-finals, 6 a Euro 1, 6 a Euro 0, winning only 17 of the 69 points in the match, and losing every one of her service games. 1. Dushavina upset world number 22 Eliza Copyright Cornet in the first round of the Wimbledon Championships, but fell to Elena Vesnina in the second. Dushavina won her first WTA career title at the 2009 A Degree Stambul Cup defeating Lucy Rodeca 6 a Euro 0, 6 a Euro 1 in the final. Equals 2010 a Euro 2011 equals Dushavina started 2010 by qualifying in the 2010 Medibank International Sydney where she reached a quarter-finals with wins over Casey Del Equa and Elena Vesnina, but lost to then world number one Serena Williams in the quarter-finals. She then fell in the first round of the 2010 Australian Open to compatriot and fifth seed Elena Dementieva 6 a Euro 2, 6 a Euro 1. At the 2010 PTT Pattaya Open, she was upset in the second round by world number 121 equal Tarina Beich cover 6 a Euro 4, 6 a Euro 1. She then fell in the first rounds of 2010 Dubai Tennis Championships and 2010 Sony Ericsson Open in the second round of 2010 BNP Paribas Open. She then reached the third round of the 2010 Family Circle Cup losing to eventual champion Samantha Stosa 6 a Euro 1, 3 a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 1 but fell early in the 2010 Indonesian Ili BNL d'Italia to Andrea Petkovic 6 a Euro 3, 6 a Euro 0. In the second round of the 2010 Mutua Madrilea plus or minus a Madrid Open, Dushavina lost the most competitive match of her career against world number one Serena Williams. Williams finally won 6 a Euro 7, 2, 7 a Euro 6, 5, 7 a Euro 6, 5. 
after 3 hours and 26 minutes despite being 5 a Euro 2 up in the final set. Dushabina had match point at 7 a Euro 6, 2, 6 a Euro 5 but could not close out the match. She was also 4 a Euro 0 up in the final set tiebreak before losing. It was also Williams' longest match. She then fell in the first rounds of the 2010 French Open and 2010 Icon International. At Wimbledon 2010 she upset French Open champion Francesca Iava in 6 a Euro 7, 0, 7 a Euro 5, 6 a Euro 1 in the first round, but fell to eventual semi-finalists for Turner Perrin cover 6 a Euro 3, 6 a Euro 4 in the following round. She reached a back-to-back quarter-finals in the 2010 Banca Copa Slovenia Open and 2010 a degree Stambul Cup losing to Anna Shakhtades to a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 3, 7 a Euro 5 and Jarmala Graf 7 a Euro 5, 6 a Euro 2, respectively. She then fell in the second round of the 2010 Western and Southern Financial Group Women's Open to Jelena Jankovia 6 a Euro 4, 3 a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 1. She then fell in the qualifying rounds of 2010 Rogers Cup and 2010 Pilot Pen Tennis. In the 2010 US Open she fell in the first round to Alona Bondarenko. In the 2010 Hansol Korea Open, she upset former world number one Arna Ivanovic to a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 4, 6 a Euro 2 but fell in the next round to Clara Zakopalova. She then reached the third round of the 2010 China Open as a qualifier losing to Francesca Iava in 4 a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 3, 6 a Euro 1. In her final tournament of the year at the 2010 Kremlin Cup, she was able to reach her first semi-final since winning in the 2009 a degree Stambul Cup, she defeated three consecutive compatriots equal to Rina Makarova, Elena Vesnina and Anna Shakhtades but fell to another compatriot Maria Kirilenko 6 a Euro 1, 6 a Euro 1. Vera started 2011 by losing in the qualifying draw of the 2011 Midibank International Sydney. At the 2011 Australian Open she was able to pick up her first win in six years by defeating Maria Elena Cameron 6 a Euro 3, 3 a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 1 but fell to fifth seed Samantha Stosa in the next round. She then fell in the first rounds of 2011 Open GDF Suez and 2011 Dubai Tennis Championships. She is currently playing at the 2011 Qatar Ladies Open, where she qualified and defeated Mara Ajoza copyright Martinez R N C H E Z for a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 1, 7 a Euro 6, 1, in the first round and lost to Daniela Hantuchuva for a Euro 6, 6 a Euro 2, 6 a Euro 4 in the second round. Personal life, outside tennis, Vera also plays football and basketball. She is also a fan of Russian films. Significant finals. Equals Premier Mandatory Premier 5 Finals equals. Doubles, 1. WTA Career Finals. Equals Singles, 4 equals. Equals Doubles, 10 equals. Singles Performance Timeline. Doubles Performance Timeline. References External links, Vera Dushavina at the Women's Tennis Association, Vera Dushavina at the International Tennis Federation, Vera Dushavina at the Fed Cup.